because we do have breaking news here in New York. It's happening near Penn Station here in New York, which obviously is a site of interest right now because trains not running as they should be, but this does not involve trains. There was an officer-involved shooting near Penn Station. Cops apparently shot a man that was attacking them allegedly with a hammer. Susan Candiotti is here with the details. Susan, what do we know? Scary moments out there, and things are just now starting to calm down. But according to a law enforcement official, this man was outside just about three blocks north of Penn Station, waving this hammer around. Police are on the scene. They try, try to get control of the man. There's a struggle. One of the officers falls to the ground. That's when another officer fires his weapon at the suspect who had the hammer. And the suspect is shot. We don't know his condition right now. The police officers appear to be okay. There are no stand uh, people, passers-by who appear to have been hurt. But right now they're conducting, as you can imagine, an investigation. There is someone who has been attacking people, the police say, That's with right. a hammer in New York, in this area. So they have been on the lookout for just this type of thing. That's right. I don't know if we have it handy, but there was even a sketch that they put out very recently. This man... As recently as Monday, there's a report of a suspect wielding a hammer who attacked a woman who is sitting in a very popular park, Union Square, in that area, attacked with a hammer. So they had uh, an idea of what this person looked like. Uh, we don't know for sure if that's him, but it appears to be the same man that they were going after. And now uh, this man is in custody. We also understand that this entire attack was captured on NYPD surveillance mm. video. So that will be interesting to see. And, of course, when something like this happens, the police will be looking for other videos from businesses in the area to see what else might have been captured on camera. But we talked to some people who work in the area, uh, one store in particular, and they said it was scary. You can imagine. Sure. They're hearing shots. Shots fired, everyone runs for cover, but now as we understand it, there's a perimeter set up and things have quieted down. If he in fact was attacking one police officer with a hammer and then the partner shot mm -hmm. him, that would be within presumably their standard operating procedure. Susan Candiotti, mm -hmm. thanks so much for being with us. We'll get some more details. We'll bring them to you as soon as we get them.